Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, welcome. Today's look is an anti-Valentine's Day look. And I wanted to stick with the Valentine's, Valentine's Day colors. So you see the reds. And I have burgundies in. I have a black in this look. And I wanted to keep everything else neutral. I do apologize for my face looking a little shiny. The light, the sunlight is just... It's just really bad filming in this room. Any other part of the apartment is really, really bad as well. Um, just bear with me on that. I am moving across country. So once I'm settled in California, I will definitely be having better videos uploaded for you guys. And skews, if you're wondering what this is, skews, those are my chicken pox scars. I have a lot of them on my face, if you're wondering. But yeah, those are chicken pox scars. So here's a look. I'm going to stop rambling. And if you would like to see how I achieve this look, please keep watching. Okay, guys, so for time's sake, what I did was I already prepped my eyes with my Too Faced Shadow Insurance. You can see that. And I added some concealer to my lid to give it one color. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my NYX Jumbo Pencil in Rust. And I'm going to apply this all over my lid and slightly above. Okay, once that's done, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a red brownish um, eyeshadow color and I'm going to use a brown script by MAC and I'm going to apply this all over my crease. Okay, next what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Brule by Wet n Wild and I'm going to apply this to my brow bone. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a red eyeshadow and I'm going to take this red eyeshadow right here from the 120 palette and I'm going to place this all over my lid and slightly above. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a matte black and I'm going to place that on my outer V area slightly into my crease. And I'm just going to use the matte black in the 120 palette. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my Wet n Wild Cream Gel Eyeliner and I'm going to apply this to my top lash line and my lower waterline. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Max Sketch and I'm going to apply this to my lower lash line three quarters of my lower lash line. Next, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take Gold Mine by MAC and I'm going to apply this in my inner tear duct and that little space that I have left on my lower lash line. Lastly, for the eyes, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take L'Oreal's Voluminous Original Mascara and I'm going to apply this to my upper lashes. And for my lower lashes, I'm going to use Tarte's Light Camera Lashes. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a contour to my face. And I'm going to use Blunt by MAC.
Next, what I'm going to do is add a blush, and I'm going to add Cargo's Laguna to my cheeks. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the Balm's Mary Lou Manizer, which is this, and I'm going to apply this as my highlight. For my lips, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Max Viva Glam 5, which is this nude color. And I'm going to take Lorax Couture Shine in Elite. And I'm going to apply this to my lips. 